everybody, welcome back to Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link. It's been a few days since my last episode, but in that, la in that episode we finished off the palace on Maze Island, defeated Karrock, and uh, we also got the winged boots that enable us to walk on water, which makes getting out of Maze Island a lot, a lot easier. We can avoid all those hidden areas that we'd have, we'd otherwise have to fight in. And we can also walk on the ocean here, completely bypassing the caves over this way. That you can't really see from here, but you know where they are if you've been watching, playing this game. Anyway, somewhere around here in this water, there's also... can't quite remember exactly where it was. But there's a... We got some form of secret out here. And there is the island palace, which we will be doing shortly, but there's a secret I want to get first. Because there's a person in town in one of the towns that said that there was gonna be a heart over the water. We have our next heart container. We now have seven bars of life. Seven bars of magic, only one container left a piece to go. So that's, we're just doing great. Alright, without further ado, let's head over to the palace. On a, on a more personal note, you know, I mentioned about, I think it was episode 4 in the Midoru Swamp Palace that, uh, that I was uh, disappointed that uh, the Zelda Symphony of the Goddess Tour wasn't anywhere remotely close to where I lived yet. Well, just a few days after I recorded that video, it hasn't even been uploaded yet at, at this point, they announced, uh, you know, some over in uh, Chicago, you know, a performance in October, and I have my ticket for that. So that, that's awesome. Real close to my birthday, too. It's just kind of like a bonus. So I'm really looking forward to that. But anyway, oh, yeah, we can't make that. Our second time using the fairy spell. We cannot pick up the key at in fairy form, so we will have to go off screen here to the next area and then return. Fend off some bubbles. There we go. First key already, and we have a. Oh no, not Roz. Oh no, I missed it. Uh, don't take my experience. I didn't get knocked into the. I forgot him. It's been a few days since I played, so I've forgotten that I don't have any lives to spare right now. door here. Got our elevator. Uh, let's check this way first. Oh, we got Magos. I believe that's what they're called. And I don't think these weird snaky Octorok, tentacle-less Octoroks are even called. I don't think they've been given an official name. And there's literally nothing here, okay? I chose poorly, apparently. Just experience for killing the lesser monsters. I'll take those lesser monsters over another Doom Knocker or whatever. But yeah, these Magus are like... They're kind of like the whiz robes in the previous palace. If 
Please don't pop the bubble until the fire's gone. Uh, nuts. I knew that was gonna happen. Uh, yeah, they teleport around like the whiz robes and just drop a little fireball that just kind of sits on the ground and... Okay, I'm just gonna wait here in the sheltered area until... Uh, until this uh, mountain thing builds up enough. So yeah, the uh, Zelda concert, it's gonna be really awesome. I'm actually going with my boss. Yeah, I was really surprised he was willing to go. It was very unexpected. One of my other co-workers, ex oh no, I forgot about that guy. One of my other co- you know, the yo no wasn't necessarily about my co-worker, but... <laughs> But yeah, he's expressed interest in going, but I'm not entirely sure if he is or not yet. So, well, we'll see how that goes. Well, I'll just wait for the fire to go away. I don't have- I only have one life to live right now, so I can't really afford to just... take damage... needlessly. Oh boy, who I can kill them in two hits now. Remember correctly. Yes. Let's just max out that power. We're gonna have a blue. Nope. No, no blue one yet. All right. Which way to go? I'm gonna take this path. going on. <laughs> die, your knuckle, die! Don't stop killing me! There we go. Hey, that's that's just cheap how they can do that. There isn't even any water there or lava or whatever. Ah, no. Blue boy. I got a magic jar out of that deal, so I got to do some healing. We're gonna have a tin suit again. And... Just because. Might as well try building up some experience. If I can get another. No, 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 no! No, I, turned, uh, I didn't make the do. I tried to make the fairy escape, but that didn't work. And again, return. Well, I will meet you guys back at the palace. Alrighty. Well, let's go this way instead this time. I don't need that. Well, that makes three deaths so far in this game. Ganon's been revived three times. It's kind of like Beetlejuice, I guess. Uh, Crap, do I keep going or I'm gonna take the elevator. I'm gonna take I think the elevator is the way to go this time. Uh, we got a doom uh, thing and my screen is really wigging out all of a sudden. That is weird. Why is my screen screwing up? I bet there's not even gonna be anything here, just a point bag. Alright, I'm around me. Okay, do I stay on this level or not? I'm gonna 
have to jump. Pretty sure this is the way. This, as we've already established, there are paths that lead to absolutely nothing in this palace. And you'd think with the winged boots, I'd be able to like automatically have the jump spell or something active, or be able to walk on lava. That would be awesome. I wouldn't have to worry about dying with those stupid uh, bras. And we have a secret wall. There's a little kid or somebody in uh, Naburu that says that there's a false wall in the palace. They don't specify which palace, but this is the palace they meant. And this is the wall they were talking about. So we got some Magos. I like Mag or Magos. Magos, Magos. Let's keep on keeping on this time. Death from below. I almost wish you got experience for killing those guys. As much of a pain as they are. The tin suits, I mean. And, uh, oh, we haven't seen a Stalfos in a while. Hey, hey. I was just thinking I needed to get a life. Hey, for big Scott Pilgrim references. Or references to gaming in general, I guess. And here's that key that we couldn't get to because the, this was the solid wall. So, back the way we came. Oh so, yeah, Island Palace. Or Ocean Palace, I mean like, yeah, Ocean Palace. Uh, have I been calling it the Island Palace all this time? That's Palace number three. Although some people call it the Graveyard Palace, even though, because you have to go through the graveyard to find the secret entrance to it. My sword shoots lasers through walls. Oh, no. My laser sword. This better be worth the trip. It's better to just ignore the fire guys. As much as you can. And we're gonna have another blue guy, aren't we? Yep, I knew it. No, 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 that's a door. I don't want to get stuck unlocking a door. So come over this way a little more. Ah, nuts. Back over this way. the flute! The staple of uh, the Zelda series, having magical musical instruments, usually wind related. You know, the flute will enable us to progress towards the final sections of Hyrule, because our path is blocked by the uh, River Devil, which I will be showcasing in the next episode. You know, he's not like a normal enemy encounter, he's just a roadblock that you have to use the flute to get around. So let's go back the way we came. I'm trying to decide if it's necessary to take the elevator down after we go through the false wall again. Nope, oh, nothing there. I was hoping for another red jar. Maybe I already got it, I can't remember. There's probably nothing there. Yeah, those fire guys are really a pain. Take too long. 
So yeah, Ocean Palace. Yeah, might as well, might as well see what's up down here. Yeah, Roz, that's what's up. And no, 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 no. Leave me alone, bubbles, bad bubbles. Man, bake me a kick as fast as you can. Uh oh. Patty cake, patty. Baker's man. Uh, good effort, but I'm the patty cake champion. And it was for nothing. Just experience. Unfortunately, the going this way is a lot easier because the bubbles spawn in a position where they don't get in your face. Alright, let's go back up here. Progress there. I'm not even going to bother with that. Ooh, that blue one didn't spawn a monster. Sometimes that happens. Okay, do I have any more keys? I'm out of keys. I don't think I need any more keys yet. And you know what? Doomranger, or whatever your name is. I don't really want anything to do with you, but I'll take that. I should pop this bubble. Such a shame I'm probably not going to level up before I get to the boss. Because, you know, once you beat the boss and you put the crystal in its pedestal, you automatically level up. If I can get the downward pogo stick going, there we go. It's so much easier. points you get for killing these guys, but they're kind of a hassle. Not sure if there's a key down here or not. Yeah. No, I'm just going to ignore him, but I'm going to have another blue guy down here. Yeah, there is a key. Okay, I'm just going to kill myself at this rate, so I'm just going to go. Maybe if I had more space to work with, I'd be able to... Alrighty, I got my key. Alright, Mr. Blue Man, Iron Knuckle, sir. Thank 
which is right here. And I don't have enough for the life spell, so I guess I better do shield. I'm probably gonna die. Uh-oh. We have Gooma. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm off to a bad start. Yep. Takes off about a whole bar of health with the shield spell on, which I will reactivate now. But Gooma, not Goomba. This guy wasn't in Mario Brothers. Ah, crap. No, 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 no. Ah, crap. Get, out. Get over here. Sprite limitations. This guy's a particularly frustrating boss, because you, can you can't hurt his head, but you have to hit his body, but he's swinging that mace around. I, I need to stop dying so much in this game. No, 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 no. Ah. Frickin' ogre guy. Ah. Why, why didn't I heal again? I, for some reason, I didn't think I could cast life again. Alright, well, I deserve to die that time. I better not get another game over. I'm gonna be... Over this way. <sighs> you gotta time your jumps just right to get over that mace, or that ball and chain, or whatever it is. Nah, I did that wrong. I glanced over at his health bar and missed my shot. Okay, one, maybe two shots left. There we go. Please be 300 or more. 500, alright! We could have used that earlier, but we got it. that, we've restored the fifth crystal to its, uh, place. We'll recharge. Our experience will level up to the next level, which is a great, great time to do that. A shortcut there. Our magic's level to seven now. That's awesome. Our spells cost just a little bit less now. Shield is 16 points. Fire's about the same. Life and Fairy are still hugely overpriced, but what, whatever. They're the important ones. Or well, least, well, they're all important in their own ways. But anyway, I think this episode has gone on long enough. This is uh, next time on Let's Play Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link. We will take care of a couple last minute things over in this part of Hyrule, then we will clear get the River Devil out of the way, and start making progress towards the sixth palace. The hidden palace. It's kind of ominous. Just a little. But alright, I will see you guys next time.